Legazzo tried to feed it through and no foul call. The play continues for Weston. Taranto, now Hieda. Hieda with a little bit of space in front of her. Hieda tried to slip a pass. Grove did so, but off the post and now out of play. But Kiwa Hieda just the width of the post away from giving Western United the lead in this game. To be a little bit chaotic, but Kiwa Hieda did really well. Got in a tight space. A real threat. Holmes to take. Sends it across. Still at Holmes. And what an excellent goal. Makes it 1-0, but it's been disallowed. That goal's been disallowed. Not sure why, but a spectacular strike of the ball from Dylan Holmes. But And wondering why that is that's disallowed. Maybe there was some holding. Not quite sure. I have no idea. So, knocked away by Dorba, but Papadopoulos still retains possession and Dorba wins it straight back. Hodgson. Down the line for Heather Hodgson. And there she is. There she is, Isabel Hodgson. Got only Grace Maher ahead of her. Takes the strike and an excellent save from Hilary Beal. Maybe she could have gone a little bit further forward as that ball was played nicely for her. And Grace Maher just maybe make her made her hesitate. Cern. Not able to get control of the ball. Hodgson comes away with it. Still Hodgson. Sends it forward, but took a deflection on its way through. And it was Emma Robers who's been replaced by Hannah Kane. So it's a attacking change for Kat Smith. And maybe would mean Chloe Legazzo might go back a little bit into the midfield, but she's quite high at the moment. Cern out wide. To the feet of Keane, forced out wide, sends it back. There's Legazzo, able to turn and spin. And a good save from Annalie Grove, but there's the skill and quality of Chloe Legazzo, able to turn and just shoot on a dime, but just couldn't find that top corner. Still Vlanich and throws it in very quickly. Seen that a lot from her this afternoon. Legazzo, still Legazzo here, going through Chloe Legazzo. And a good save from Annalie Grove. But uh, no one's been able to get into the back of the net just yet and make it count, at least. Legazzo, Savisky. Still Savisky with the long range effort. But an easy grab in the end for Grove. Seen a lot more of Annalie Grove in this second half. Good crowd at City Vista. Legazzo. Savisky. Hieda. Hieda's done really well, Kiwa Hieda. A fantastic finish from the Japanese national. What a goal. Really good bit of footwork. And Western United make that attacking change at half time. And it's paid off. Is now they are one nil up against Adelaide United. You take a look, Savisky did well. He ate up, took the ball away from Hodgson and a calm finish. Saw her do a lot of that in the MPL in Victoria for Calder. And she's been doing it for Western United this season. Holmes to Blake. Lee under pressure, needs to find an outlet. Slips it through. For Dorba, who sends it across. And there is a back heel, but straight into the hands of Hilary Beal. And not enough movement off the ball for Beal. Tonkin. Grove, straight to the feet of Grace Ma. Taranto with the strike. And just over the crossbar. They're having a lot of issues. Adelaide United getting out of their defence. 
Yanchevsky. Looks like Hodgson was getting held there. Referee Beck Mackey disagrees. Now feeding it through for Hannah Keane. Keane threw on goal. Tonkin pushed off the ball, but did enough to interrupt the strike from Hannah Keane and Annalie Grove able to save it. But Hannah Keane still limping from that previous challenge with Zoe Tolan out wide. But there's Legazzo. You can take a strike, Chloe Legazzo. Just wide of goal. We take a look at that chance from Hannah Keane. Ella Tonkin just got nudged off the ball in the end, and that strike from Keane was straight at the chest. Take that strike from Chloe Legazzo. Really nice.